Hey, hello friends. Welcome to my channel, SAPSD and ABAP League Support. One of our friend requested to publish a video about how to do automatic delivery creation and automatic post goods issue and how can we do invoice creation in automatic way. Now let's get started. First thing is that so let's uh, focus on the uh, how can we create the deliveries automatically the first t code or program that comes to our mind is that vl10c this is that uh, t code to create the deliveries either single delivery or collective deliveries the back end program for this t code is that rvb 50 r10 c let me go to the system so vl 10 c so here we need to create the variant right based on that uh, shipping point delivery creation date everything and we should schedule this as a background job this is one of the best way to schedule the delivery jobs the report is rvv 50 r 10 c so how can we check this uh, report name in this t code so we are now in vl 10 c transaction code if you go to the system in the menu then click on status you see this rvv 50 r 10 c so with the help of this uh, report a background job can be scheduled this is the top priority top option to schedule the delivery create the delivery in automatic way and uh, second way is that we can use the bdc program so we have bdc so bdc is nothing but batch data communication so this is the one of the technique to transfer the data from sap to sap or non sap to sap so the transaction code to access the bdc is that shdb so in shdb we should develop the recording here so how to do that for example i am going to record the delivery creation in this t code remember the t code is shdb so what i can do and click new recording and i can give some g test del and uh, give the t code what is the t code to create the delivery is vl 1 n now start recording you see i came to the t code vl 1 n so here i can enter all the details and i can save the delivery once everything is done right so once everything is done you see it has been recorded i didn't do anything as of now i just went to vl01n and i have removed that uh, shipping point details right so to till that step it has been recorded if i process this for example click ok you see it came here and if i click enter that's it done so i don't do anything here so we need to record all the steps go inside this delivery screen wheel 01 n and uh, do the picking pga and save the delivery if you do the recording for entire steps means that will be recorded as an bdc program and we can use this uh, recording in the custom program to create the 
deliveries this is the second way we can use the bdc concept and hereafter we can see the function models available to create the deliveries the first one is that shp underscore vl10 underscore delivery underscore create so by using this fm we can create the deliveries i am going to sm sorry sc 37 so by using this one also we can create the deliveries and one more fm is that it's a bopi basically bopi means business application programming interface so bopi and underscore delivery processing underscore exec so by using this fm also we can try to create the deliveries it's a bopi it's an rfc enabled function model you see it's a bopi means bopi always rfc enabled function model let me see the previous one also bopi previous one is not a bopi it's normal function model only okay and uh, the next function model is that gn underscore delivery underscore create so by using this one also delivery creation can be done automatically so you might ask me how can we use this function models right so for that what we can do first we need to develop one custom report or custom function model in that function custom program we need to call this function models and feed the data to create the deliveries so we should input the data to create the deliveries for that we should develop one custom program that custom program can be later scheduled as a background job the next one is that and again we have bapi only bapi underscore outb underscore delivery create delivery create underscore sls okay so this bapi is used to create the deliveries with reference yes so delivery can be created with reference to sales order or po stock transfer order right so in these cases we can go with this function model bapi outb delivery create sls suppose i want to create the delivery without reference so if you go to vl01n transaction code here we have option right by default we are in the with reference screen that's why it's asking to enter the order number if you want to create an order without reference also possible for that we should select this one right in both of the ways we can create that uh, deliveries to create a delivery automatic way without any reference then uh, we should use another function model that is create no ref so bopi out be delivery create no reference so by using this function model we can create the deliveries without reference and one more last fm that we can use for sto scenarios that is bopi outb underscore delivery underscore create sto so this many ways this many programs can be used to schedule the delivery creation job automatically 
right so this is can be done automatically without any coding custom code is not required directly you can schedule it as a background job and coming to this function model this function model should be used in our custom program as per the client requirement and develop the custom program then input all the data to this uh, any one of this function model and try to create the deliveries and this is a standard recording way shdb is a transaction code okay now let's see the pgi programs so how can we done pgi related things again here also first thing we can use the t code that is vl 060 let me open this so vl 060 is outbound delivery monitor transaction code so here also we can uh, do that uh, automatic way of doing the post codes issue you see here we have in multiple options are here for loading for confirmation picking goods issue right now we'll click this for goods issue and enter all the required parameter here then you see this option to run in background or in the menu we can run this in background as a background job this is one of the way to do the pgi automatically the t code is vl 6 o and the program is this is the program ws monitor out b del gdsi and similar way again via bdc ssdb is the transaction code and we have several function models available here as well let me tell you one by one the first one is that sd shipment underscore post goods underscore issue let me open this yeah by using this one we can do the post goods issue and the next one is that we can use one more uh, fm cs1 score p underscore del sorry dlb rt underscore goods goods issue underscore create okay cs4 p dlb rt goods issue underscore create this is one of the fm and the next the last one is ws underscore delivery underscore update so by using this fm also we can do the post goods issue so these are the ways for post goods issue and coming to the automatic way of creating the invoices okay so to create an invoice the first thing comes to our mind is that vf06 that is rv60 sbat program so if i go to vf06 i need to enter all the parameters here then go to the program execute in background so rv60 sbat is the program to schedule the billing batch of automatically so this rvx 60 s bad program in the background will create one child job that child job is nothing but a vf04 transaction code only right this is the first way and here also we can go with the bdc but still so for invoicing we never recommended to go with the bdc because we can use standard report available to schedule as a background job and uh, there is a function model also available 
that is a gn underscore invoice underscore create so by using this function model also we can create the deliveries let me open that sc37 gn underscore invoice underscore create so in my project we have been using this function model in several custom programs to create the invoices automatically this is not a BAPI, this is a normal function model only. So this many ways are available to do delivery, delivery creation automatically, post goods issue automatically and invoice creation automatically. If you guys know any other programs or reports available to do this automatically means, please do let me know in the, in the comment section. I will also learn from you. That's it from this video friends. We'll meet in the next video. Thanks everyone. Bye for now.